The turbines, as I said, they can also be classified as with or without steam extraction. Extraction is nothing more than removing steam from within of the turbine after passing through some stages. Then the steam enters the turbine with high potential energy and after passing through some stages, part of this vapor leaves through extraction and goes to the process. The part that remains in the turbine expands until it exits through the turbine exhaust. Extractions are found in both condensing turbines as counter pressure. They can even have more than one extraction in the same turbine. Extractions can be classified as controlled extractions, which is when the turbine has an internal device assembly to control the steam outlet pressure. The extraction disc, actuator, sensor and valves are the elements used to feed industrial processes. These extractions are normally used, controlled, since these processes require constant pressure. Thus, regardless of the turbine load, the extraction pressure will always be the same. The advantage of having controlled extraction is that the operation of the industrial process can be guaranteed, even with the turbine operating at low load. An example of turbines that use controlled extraction. These are turbines destined for the paper and cellulose sector. They are very common. The use of controlled extraction makes the turbine efficiency greater compared to using just plugs or steam bleeds. Regardless of the type of turbine, we can program control of extractions, prioritizing generation over extraction, or vice versa. Remembering that the acquisition of a minimum load condition to start extractions, this control is carried out by a system, electronic control that I will talk about later in our course. Also uncontrolled extractions known as takes or bleeding. In this type of extraction it is simply a removal of steam from inside the turbine and its pressure depends on the current turbine load. Extraction for turbines used in regenerative cycles, which we have already talked about a little here, which uses steam from inside the turbine for heating boiler feed water, almost always of the uncontrolled type, calls, shots or bleeding. They have the advantage of being low cost and easy to operate. They are normally used to power cycle equipment, deaerators, preheaters for industrial processes that do not require constant pressure. <laughs>